there guys welcome back uh, today I'm outside my house uh, right by my AC condenser line and as you can see this thing is uh, puddling up pretty good um, basically anybody who has a uh, air conditioning you're gonna have an, a condenser line that's gonna go somewhere out to the outside some people uh, have it running off into a uh, balcony area or a little hidden area uh, but number one you don't want this uh, water pooling up by the house and uh, number two uh, it's a good resource to put on a plant or something like that so you would either throw like a bucket underneath there, uh, just collect the water. Um, but what I'm going to do, I had some scrap uh, uh, irrigation line and some scrap PVC. And basically, uh, the only two pieces I bought was uh, this. It's just a little three-quarter inch uh, corner piece uh, or elbow. And then a three-quarter inch to uh, irrigation line uh, fitting. I think literally for like a buck thirty between both of them. I think one was 40-some cents and the other was like 80 cents. Um, anyway, so what I'm going to do is use this scrap PVC. I'm going to take this guy off of here. I'm going to put this on here. And then uh, hook my irrigation line into it. And I'll show you where it's directed to. Well, I've got it hooked up now. And uh, I've got the AC uh, compressor going. So I'm not going to, not sure if you're going to be able to hear this too well. But uh, basically, I just left this line on the ground. Um, because if this ever gets clogged, I just, this is all friction fit by the way, if it gets clogged, I just want to be able to, it, to be able to pop off with the pressure of the water, uh, just because obviously I don't want uh, anything backflowing into the house. But we'll just follow it over here. Come down here to my little uh, pomegranate, and as you can see, it's been uh, dripping water for a little bit now. This is a, a little bit. This has probably been about half an hour. Um, and I have no idea, but you know, maybe like a, a tenth of a gallon or something has uh, come over here just in the drips. Uh, maybe a little bit less, but anyway, it's uh, just something to think about, especially if you're in a dry environment. Uh, really easy. And uh, the other thing I wanted to point out, this scrap irrigation, has uh, it's got some holes in it in some places, but uh, you don't even have to buy this stuff. You can find it on Craigslist all day long. People uh, throw this stuff away as they change their uh, irrigation out. So anyway, just something to think about. You might have to buy a couple fittings from Home Depot, but really not more than maybe a dollar or two at the most. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching.